What is up guys and thank you for joining me again for yet another soap review. Today I got something that I picked up from my local Dollar Tree and that is the Yardley London Soap. This one is the Lavender Scent and uh, you know I gotta be honest with you I did not have high expectations for this soap when I bought it. I was reading a lot of reviews online and I heard a lot of things about you know the smell and uh, just in general you know it's cleaning power and that it's cheap and this sort of bad uh, views on it just because it came from the Dollar Tree. But you know what? Honestly, don't knock something until you try it yourself. I was pleasantly surprised with this soap. So let's start off with the boxing. Well, the price alone. I paid this $1.25. It's written right on the side. Um, boxing is nice. It comes individually wrapped. These come at about 4.25 ounces or 120 grams. Uh, it comes in these individually packed boxes here. Not bad. Typical cardboard box. So like I said, this is the lavender scent. I'm going to post a little snippet of what the soap looked like when I pulled it out of the box. Um, it's a good size bar, 4.25 ounces. I used it for a period of five days. And this is what I have left of the bar right now. So the wear down is pretty good, honestly. Uh, the bar itself is... A really nice shape um, it feels like a luxurious bar I mean it has this beautiful oval shape with a really nice clef in it and it was one of the most comfortable bars that I've used on my body uh, I didn't drop this once and I have to say that the quality of the bar itself uh, you know just the engineering of it it's pretty good for something that's being sold at the dollar store right the scent of this bar threw me off at first I didn't like it when I just smelled the box it had this weird old lady perfume smell. But once I got it in the shower, it, it dumbed down that sort of old perfume smell. And the smell of the lavender was really enjoyable, actually. I liked it. Um, holding the bar up to your nose brings out that old lady perfume smell. Getting it in the shower and running it underwater smells totally different. The smell doesn't really linger on your skin when you come out of the shower, especially if you're a man. That's probably a good thing because this is a more feminine scented uh, soap. I wouldn't call this manly at all. Uh, it had a weaker lather. Uh, unfortunately, this bar didn't lather too great, but uh, it was more of like an oily, creamy lather. When I used it with the loofah, it had a pretty decent lather. Well, what doesn't with the loofah, right? The one thing I noticed about this bar that I felt was one of the weirdest things that I've ever experienced with a soap is that the friction between the soap and my body and my skin and my body when I was lathering, you know, there was, it wasn't slippery. It was almost like squeaky clean to the point where when I was drying myself off and even in the shower, the water was just beating off my skin as if I, uh, Put a layer of wax or something i found that really weird i don't know if that's a good or a bad thing any soap engineers out there hey let me know if that's a good or a bad thing um didn't really leave my skin dry at all just kind of left my skin in a neutral position um and I, I i enjoyed it you know what it wasn't that bad i'm not gonna uh say it's the greatest soap i've ever used but it's definitely not the worst um i don't know how good this is for your skin itself i mean it didn't dry me out as much as like irish spring or anything like that but um, overall, it wasn't a bad experience at all. Anyways, folks, that is the Yardley London Lavender Review. Thank you for tuning in. Stay clean.